PWA support in Apex is a multi-release project. While we implement highly requested PWA features declaratively, Apex developers have been asking about opening up the PWA engine to allow them to inject their own code. In Apex 22.1, we've completely redesigned the shared components home and it features a new page dedicated to PWA attributes, reinforcing our commitment to the technology and the space it occupies inside Apex. On this page, you will find three sections. General, which allows you to enable or disable top-level PWA features. Appearance, which provides a number of declarative options for driving the look and feel of your PWA. And lastly, Apex 22.1 now features a section for configuring the service worker. Using the default service worker, your application benefits from the new Apex caching system, as well as the offline fallback page. But now, developers can choose to configure hooks to extend the default service worker and inject their own service worker logic. There are over 20 hooks to choose from, offering a wide variety of locations to extend the service worker functionality. All of them are documented within Apex and they are displayed with user-friendly code preview. When used correctly, these hooks can allow Apex applications to send push notifications, do web app payments, push app updates in the background, and more. Until Apex can build the ultimate PWA out of the box, we are excited to let developers be creative with this new extensible structure, and we cannot wait to provide real examples on how to leverage the most out of your PWA.